the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me for today's video. Today is going to be my spring home tour and I am so excited to walk around my home and just show you guys all the areas that I decorated and talk about where everything is from, including prices and so on. You guys already know how these videos go, but I'm even more excited to tell you guys that this video is in collab with five other amazing ladies here on YouTube. You guys have already heard me talk about each of them and I have been very privileged to collab with most of them in the past, but yes, I'm so excited. This video is in collab with Kaylin Cash, Jessica Giffen, Lorena Rosales, Crystal Terra, and Sky from House and Home. And to add more to the excitement, it is also a giveaway for a chance to win two $175 gift cards to shop house and home. And yes, you heard that right. We are gifting two separate gift cards to two lucky winners. And all of the details will be down below in the description box for you guys. But it's pretty simple. And basically, just make sure you watch each of our home tours. Make sure you are subscribed to each of us and that you leave a comment in each one of our videos. But in general, that is it. The giveaway will be open for a week. And we basically wanted to give you guys enough time to see all of our home tours and just get inspired, soak it all up. And that is it. That is how you enter this giveaway. As always, I hope you guys love this video and all of their videos will be linked down below in the description box. And if you are new to my channel and you are coming over from one of these amazing, talented ladies channel. My name is Kaz, I am 23 years old. I am married to my husband, Jonathan, who is my middle school sweetheart. We have three dogs, no babies, but hopefully some in the future. And yes, I love doing home decor and homemaking style videos, and I hope you decide to stick around. But without much more rambling, let's go ahead and get into this video because I am sure it is going to be a long one. So definitely make yourself some coffee, some tea or some water and cuddle up on your couch to enjoy this video. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Okay friends, so we are gonna get started over in my entryway. I absolutely love this space in my home. This is actually a makeshift entryway and we actually made the space after moving around some furniture over during Christmas time, but I absolutely love it and I like that it just gives you a little walkway when you are coming into our home and I absolutely love it. To start off over in my door, I just laid down a yellow rug for a beautiful pop of color. I think spring is the perfect time to add those pops of colors that you usually don't add throughout the year. And this rug was super inexpensive at Target. It was only $13, so I think it's such a steal. I think it's actually meant to go on the outside part of your home, but I think adding one on the inside also really makes a difference and I just love the touch of decor that it adds and then moving on to the table in my entryway this table is actually from home goods I wish I could link it but home goods always has such amazing entryway tables for such good prices I believe this one was just under $200 when we purchased it and then the mirror up on top is actually a mirror my husband made for me so again I cannot link it but it's one of those pieces that I love and it's a staple decor piece in my home but now let's go ahead and move on over to the decor pieces I actually have on the table I love the way this turned out so let's just go ahead and get into the detail of it Okay, so starting in this corner of the table, I really love the look of this. I tried to go with a bird theme in a way. So I have this Ray Dunn birdhouse. This was from last year and I got it for about $20 from TJ Maxx. And then this beautiful bird cage right here is from Michaels. They do have it again this year. 
and this beautiful bird right here i absolutely love this so much this is from hobby lobby this year and this is the smaller of the two sizes that they had and that was a 30 dollars. i did use a 40 percent coupon and then moving over here i have this cute little pedestal from hobby lobby with this beautiful pink vase that was actually a hearth and hand candle that I just burnt out, washed out, and used as a vase. I put some greenery inside of it as well as this cute little ceramic bird from Hobby Lobby. And I love the look of this and such a perfect way to repurpose that candle. And then this wooden piece back here is actually from Walmart. It was only $7, I want to say, but I actually only rang it up for 5 So I just love that touch of wood that it adds. And I just felt like I needed something in the middle of this table to kind of tie in this corner over here with this corner since this corner is so simple but still i love how it came out i just have this picture frame with a picture of jonathan and i and a picture of jonathan when he was a small little kid and then this hearth and hand candle i got during summertime last year these baskets are from Hobby Lobby. They still have them again this year. They're from the spring shop and these cute little bunnies are also from Hobby Lobby. I believe they were $13.99 and I did use a 40% off coupon and I just love the look of them. But that is it for the top of this entryway table. Now let's move on to the bottom. So for the bottom of this table, I have this beautiful basket I got from Hobby Lobby last year. I absolutely love it and inside of it, I just added some greenery as well as this pink throw that is from Target and it's from the Hearth and Hand line. And then over to this corner, I just laid down two different pillows. The It's So Good To Be Home is actually a pillow cover I got from Amazon. And then this white pillow is from the Hearth and Hand line at Target. I got it on clearance after Christmas. And then this cute little bunny vine figurine is from Hobby Lobby. And they did have some this year again. And then I just have my wax warmer. This is also from Hobby Lobby, but quite a few years ago. I absolutely love it and I always have it out. And that is it for the bottom of this table. Okay friends, and now for my living room. I absolutely love this area of my home and I try to make it very cozy because Jonathan and I both spend so much time here and when we have people over, this is the space that we spend the most time in. So I absolutely love making it cozy and decorating it so it's still functional, but it still looks beautiful. So real quick, a few questions I always get is, where are my couches from? My sectional is from Ashley Furniture as is my coffee table and my side table. Those will be linked down below in the description box. And as for my foam fireplace, my husband actually made it and we just purchased a fireplace insert from Amazon. That will also be linked down below. But let's go ahead and get into the little detailed decor so you guys can know where everything is from. Okay, so starting in this corner, the side table is from Ashley Furniture. The lamp is from Target and then I just placed this leather pot I got from Hobby Lobby with a real life plant and then this cute little bunny is from TJ Maxx last year and the jute placemat is from Target. It was only $10 I believe and it is in their kitchen supply area. And then moving on to my couches in this corner right here, I did go ahead and lay down this throw. Although it is a cheetah print or leopard print, I think that the pastel pink looks beautiful. This is from Sam's. It was only $10, so I really do love it. And then for the pillows, both of the pillows in the back are pillow covers from Amazon. The pink lumbar pillow is from Target from the Hearth and Handline summer collection of last year and i absolutely love this combination i loved that i was able to keep my leather pillow 
And then moving on to this other corner over here, this is what I call my cute little fun corner of pillows. I have this beautiful floral print pillow in the back that is from Target's Studio McGee line this year and it was $22 and then this one right here is also from Target and also the green one and these both were $15 I really love the cute little bunny detail on this one it's so subtle yet so cute and then moving to this corner I have the same pillowcases I had in the other one and this pillow right here is from the Hearth and Handline this year. And I just like that small detail of yellow. And that is it for the pillows. For my coffee tray over my coffee table, I just have this beautiful woven tray. I believe it's a serving platter. It is from the Hearth and Handline at Target. And I think it matches perfectly with these wickered coasters that are also from the Hearth and Handline. These were $12 and the tray was $22. And then I have this beautiful candle that you guys might recognize already. It is from the Hearth and Hand line at Target this year. I love the scent of this and I just love how evenly they burn. They actually burn completely out of the bowl, which is perfect if you want to reuse it. Hence why I was able to reuse the pink one over in my entryway table. And then I do have my cozy white cottage book down here and on top of it I have this beautiful blue pot holder or plant holder. This is from Hobby Lobby. It was around $7 and I just have some greenery inside of it. And then this bunny right here is also from Hobby Lobby and it is one of my favorite additions to my spring decor. Okay, so moving on to this side of my living room, uh, let's go ahead and start with this ladder right here. This is from Hobby Lobby and it was $40 and then the blanket on it is from the Threshold brand at Target. I want to say this was around $20 and it was part of their spring launch. And then down here I just have a wickered basket with some leather handles and dog toys in it because dog mom life. And then over on my mantle, I have a few garlands hung in front of it. I love this cute little pom-pom garland. This is from Michaels this year. It was 15. And then these two garlands right here are actually two garlands that I just intertwined. This one is a greenery from Hobby Lobby. And then this one was from Walmart during Christmas and I just stained it a darker color. And then up here, I just have a cute little rocking bunny from Michaels, and this plant is from Target, and this was only $15. I absolutely love it. It looks so real, and so much so that I even watered it the other day, but I love the detail of the pot, and I just think it looks super cute right there. And over at the other corner of my mantle, I just have these beautiful candlesticks with some pillar candles on top of them. These candlesticks are from the Threshold brand at Target and they were $15 each. Okay, so moving on to this corner of my living room, I love that I was able to bring in some warmth with this sign I got from Hobby Lobby a while back, but they do have it again this year. I just love what it says. I love the quote and it just brings me so much peace and calmness during the day. And then my plant stand is from Ikea and all the plants on it are live plants I've gotten throughout the years. And they are all in these cute little wickered baskets from the Target Dollar Spot. I just love how warm this little corner turned out and how it ties the ladder at the other side of my mantle. And I just really do love how this turned out. with you and flowers 
Okay friends, so we are now in my dining room area. I love decorating this space because not only is our dining room table here, but my coffee bar is also here and I love decorating this space. It is very quite frequently visited throughout the day. I am a coffee drinker 100%, so I spend a lot of time during the day coming on over to make myself some coffee and I just love that I get to enjoy the beautiful decor for my actual dining room table, I kept it pretty simple and I just laid down a beautiful woven a table runner I got from Hobby Lobby from their spring shop. It was $14.99 if I remember correctly and of course it was 40% off and on top of it again just kept it very simple and added another one of those uh, Target plants that I loved. This one was marked $25 but it actually rang up for $20 so I definitely could not pass up on it and I just love the beautiful pot that it comes in and it just looks so realistic to me but then that was basically it for my dining room table if you guys have any questions as to where it is from it is also from Ashley furniture home store so I really do love it but I'm thinking about switching it out soon anyways let's go ahead and move on over to the coffee bar area Okay friends, so we are starting in this corner of my coffee bar area. You guys already know that I love these lockers. These are from Hobby Lobby and although they are not vintage or antique, they definitely give me that look that I was going for. And inside of them we do store all of our coffee supplies including like mugs and syrups and so on. And on top of it, this planter is from Hobby Lobby. They do have it again this year. Basically all of my decor is from there or from Target. But then I have some greenery inside of it that is also from Hobby Lobby. And then this beautiful frame in the back, I do not know where it's from. One of my friends gifted this to me and I just DIY'd that insert inside of it and just used some vintage book pages I printed from Google and a cute little bunny that I also printed from Google and that was it for this corner. Now for the top of my mug shelf, this sign is from Hobby Lobby. I have not seen it since last year, unfortunately, but I do love what it says. Every family has a story. Welcome to ours and I love that chalkboard green color. Again, this little plant stand is from Hobby Lobby this year and then I just put some terracotta pots at the top that I did age with some garden lime and some greenery inside of them and then a cute little bunny in that corner. The mug shelf is actually made by my husband. A lot of you guys already know that but in case you don't, it is a you know shelf that my husband made for me last year he's so sweet and we will be replacing this soon so i think this is the last time i'm going to be decorating this but nonetheless inside of the little compartments i do have my ray dunn mugs in the cute pastel colors so i have hop into spring honey bunny happy spring hop to it and those are from different stores like marshall's tj maxx and home goods and then on the little hooks, I usually have mugs on these hooks. For this time, I decided to do something different and I hung a kitchen towel towards the back just to fill up some of that empty white space. And in front of it, I added this beautiful blue pitcher from Hobby Lobby. These cute little spoons, I think this just serves us well for when we're making our coffee. We can just measure out the um, coffee grounds for our coffee machine. And then this beautiful basket is also from Hobby Lobby's a Spring Shop this year. And I just added some more greenery inside of it. And then down here, I added this wicker tear tray. This is from Target's Dollar Spots. And it just has an assortment of different things inside of it, including some Ray Dunn creamer and pitcher set. And then the blue little house from Michaels. The bunnies are also from Hobby Lobby. And the white ceramic pieces are also from Hobby Lobby. And then I just added an assortment of colored Easter eggs in those little bowls as well as around the actual tray and the canisters are also from Hobby Lobby. Of you. 
And lastly is my kitchen. I, again, just one of those places that I spend a lot of time in. And my house is pretty small, so I guess all of these spaces are spaces I spend time in. But starting over here on this counter, I just have my white kitchen aid, my flour and sugar Raydan canisters. They actually do have flour and sugar. And then my Magnolia Table cookbook on this wooden cook stand that is from Hobby Lobby. And then an assortment of different wooden tools or cooking tools inside of my Happy Spring crock. I do like that this crock is pink on the inside. You guys can't really tell, but it is. And I just love it so much. So simple. And this is very functional for me because, like I said, I do spend a lot of time cooking and baking. So this has to be working and functional area. And then over in this corner, I did have a little bit more fun. I added this vintage scale that, again, my friend Olivia gifted to me. It is a vintage and beautiful scale. And on top of it, I just layered a kitchen towel from the Hearth and Handline. This year, some greenery and some tulips from the Target Dollar Spot. Some little eggs and moss eggs. And then this concrete set of bunnies this was from marshall's i believe last year and my napkin holder or towel holder i'm not sure what to call this but you guys know what i mean i got the actual holder from home goods and then at the top of my fridge i just have all of my cake stands and some cute little bunnies up at the top and that is it moving on to this wall Okay, and now for my kitchen rods. I love decorating this area and I know a lot of you guys like it as well. The actual rods are from Amazon. I will have them linked down below. And as always, I just have a lot of wooden things on it. All of my cutting boards are from different places such as Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, and TJ Maxx. And then the little wooden rolling pins that you guys see hung on them are from house and home the little bunny spatula is from tj maxx but you can find those anywhere basically and then up at the top as you guys saw i have this yellow hello spring sign that is from michael's this year the pot holders are from the hearth and hand line this year and they are from their spring line so they should still be available that vintage hand mixer is from hobby lobby the pink striped towel is from Hearth and Hand. It came in a pack of two with the one I have on my scale for $10. And the yellow one is also from Target from their Threshold brand. That one was $3. And then these cute little carrots are from TJ Maxx. And that is basically it. I really do love decorating these rods every single season and they are one of my favorite parts of my home. The last little bit of decor is over by my sink. I just have this wooden tray from Hobby Lobby with a Raydan soap dispenser. This cute little pink one is from Target's Spring Line this year for their bathroom actually. And then I just have a little wooden brush and some greenery and that is everything. What if the world had What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There be no wars. Alrighty friends, while well, that is everything that I have for you guys, I hope this video brought you so much inspiration to decorate your home and I hope you guys go on over to all of the other videos that will be linked down below and enter the giveaway for one of the gift cards that we are gifting and yes, I'm really happy. I hope you guys loved it. As always, if you guys did, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you have not. And until my next video, I hope you guys have an amazing day. I will see you guys then. Bye.